in 2008, before the primaries, I wrote about Obama. No, nothing much was known about him. He had no record. But I just took a look at his record and his presentations of himself on his own website. And it was obvious that this person has no principles. Uh, there's, he's, there's nothing but rhetoric, you know. I mean, for example, uh, you take a look on his website, 2008, before the primaries. Uh, so, for example, take a look at his... When he was a senator, he had almost no record. But he did do a few things, and he was very proud of them. And one of the things he emphasized on his website was that in the year 2006, when Israel invaded Lebanon for the fifth time, practically destroyed half of it, uh, uh, Obama sponsored a resolution in the Senate uh, in, uh, in t demanding that the U.S. government permit Israel to continue the attack until it achieves its objectives and to punish anyone, Hezbollah, Syria, Iran, which tries to impede Israel in its destruction of Lebanon, uh, destroying half the, so then half the country again, as they've done repeatedly, killing, uh, killed over a thousand people. That was the achievement that he was most proud of in the Senate. And it goes on like that. The rest of it was empty rhetoric. Uh, hope, uh, change, I'm a nice guy, you know, and so on and so forth. But try to find something else. Uh, there was no reason to be disillusioned because there was no reason for the illusions in the first place. And uh, when you look, you can see it. You know? And uh, it's true, but it's true that people are kind of always waiting for a savior. And no savior is going to come. That's not how things work. Uh, it's, uh, you know, you can, if people can create the conditions under which some decent person may become a spokesperson, but they don't come from above and organize the movements. I mean, take, say, Martin Luther King, a very significant person. I respect him a lot. Now, he would have been the first to tell you that he did not create the civil rights movement. The civil rights movement was created by uh, young black activists in the South who sat in at lunch counters, uh, rode freedom buses, got beaten, tortured, killed, tried to register people, formed the Student Nonviolent Coordinating Committee, finally drew in supporters from the North, you know, finally had a big mass movement. And uh, Martin Luther King was an effective spokesperson for it. And he deserves plenty of credit for that. I don't criticize it. But that's how leaders come. And interesting, it's interesting to notice what happened with Martin Luther King. Uh, there's now a national holiday in the United States, Martin Luther King Day. And every year there's a lot of rhetoric and what a wonderful person and so on. Take a look at it. Almost invariably the rhetoric stops with Martin Luther King's I have a dream speech in Washington, okay, which did lead to significant civil rights legislation because of the mass movement. He didn't stop there. He went on to confront class issues. He went on to the North. In fact, when he was assassinated, he was supporting a public worker strike, sanitation worker strike in Memphis, Tennessee. And he was on his way to form, to lead a march on Washington, again, to form a poor people's movement not a black movement, a poor people's movement to strike at class issues. Uh, he was assassinated. Uh, the march took place anyway, led by his widow. They did set up a tent city in Washington, Resurrection City. Uh, con this is the most liberal Congress in American history. They let it stay there briefly. Then they sent in the police in the middle of the night and smashed it up and drove everybody out of town. Uh, that part of Martin Luther King's history is gone. Uh, it's okay from the point of view of a northern liberal. It's fine to attack racist sheriffs in Alabama, but don't look at what we're doing. That's not allowed. And there was not enough popular support for his later efforts to succeed. 
And that's the fault of people like us who didn't do the things we should have done. It's not going to get a leader who'll save you unless you do the work. Then you can get spokespersons, but uh, nothing else. Yeah.